just love how many weddings, Ivy. <laughs> you never know what will happen, do you? Mm, yes, which is why I may never attend another one again. <laughs> First, Alistair surprises everyone by marrying Teresa. And then he calmly announces that he's adopting her son. And little Ethan will be the sole heir of his entire fortune. You know, I honestly think he has crossed the line into absolute insanity. <laughs> Well, I'm sure almost everyone in this room agrees with you there. You must be absolutely devastated by the news that he's just disinherited your son, Fox. Not to mention your your daughter's fancy and her sister. And, of course, his, his own children, Julian and Sheridan and Julian's bastard son, Chad. All of them suddenly financially destitute. Except, of course, for those trust funds. But I understand that Fox has already spent his. You know, you're not making me feel any better, Tabitha. <laughs> oh, well. At least Teresa's happy. <laughs> yes, when Alistair dies, her son will inherit all the crane power and money. <laughs> oh, I suppose that, that is a bit painful for you, is it, Ivy? I've never been a big fan of Teresa's. <laughs> I'm not surprised. <laughs> I mean, if she hadn't revealed that Ethan was Sam's son and not Julian's son, and all that power and money would have come to him, wouldn't it? I need another drink. that Alistair has visited on these poor, foolish mortals. He's almost as bad as us, isn't he, my little witchling? Us of the dark side. <laughs> you are now the prince of the Crane Empire. Little Ethan. And one day you will be king. And I'll teach you how to rule them. Your subject. With no mercy. Oh, yes. There's plenty of pain and agony in store. The citizens of Army. <laughs> Your smile's a dead giveaway, Tabitha. You suspected this all along, didn't you? Suspected what, dear? Uh, that Alistair would disinherit his own children and grandchildren in favor of Teresa's kid? You knew he was going to adopt little Ethan, didn't you? Well, yes, I suppose I did suspect it might happen, yes. You know what? You probably had a hand in it. Like cast some evil spell or something. You know what? Thanks a lot. Fox is devastated. You're just as evil as Alistair. There's no need to be insulting. I'm much more evil than Alistair. Oh, God. Your anger's aimed in the wrong direction, Kay. Attack ship coming up starboard, and you don't even know it. <laughs> oh, look at the proud papa. <laughs> oh, and Dora, I've just had a brilliant idea. When we go home tonight, we'll cast a spell, and one day, when you're older, you and Little Ethan will get married. Oh, oh, think of all the evil power you two will have. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait until you and little Ethan are married. <laughs> Chalk one up for the dark side, my darling little demon. 